<laughs> this brush is the she. <laughs> Do you have it? Yeah. It's so good. I know, it's really nice. I'm really excited I got it. I use it for my under eyes a lot too. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a makeup look featuring the Sigma Nightlife Palette, which was co-created by Camilla or Camila Coelho. I'm not really sure, but what's cool about it is she is actually a YouTuber as well, and she's been very successful in YouTube and got to partner up with Sigma to create a whole line of products, and I have a few of them here to show you, and I featured them all in this look that I'm wearing right now. I am an affiliate with Sigma, so they did send me these products to create a look with, which I'm very thankful for. For. So thanks Sigma. It was even so cute. Like first of all, all the stuff is wrapped so nicely and they sent me like a little card. So I just, I don't know, they're so sweet. I have been using Sigma forever. They are my first brush set that I ever purchased and they're based in Minnesota. So it's cool and I'm just a huge fan of their brand. So I definitely recommend checking out their company and this collection down below. I have my affiliate link in the description bar as well as a 10% off coupon. That said, if you want to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. So I will have everything that I am using listed in the description bar, but I already have foundation and my eyebrows done, so I'm starting off with eyeshadow and I will be using the palette from the Nightlife Collection. And then on the E25 brush that came in the brush set, I'm going to apply this color into the crease and on my lid and then also below my lower lash line. Next, using an E55 that I also received in the brush set, I'm taking the color Boogie, which is a navy blue, and I'm applying that all over my lid. And I did have to work with this color a little bit to build it up because I think it's meant to be kind of like a sheer color, but I ended up loving the way that it came out. And then I'm just using, I think it's called Panache on the outer corner just to blend the dark blue up into the crease and just create a smoother transition. And then this is another Sigma brush that I already had, but I'm just um, blending more of the first transition shade to make sure everything's blending well. And then on a angled brush, I'm taking a mixture of... Uh, two colors in the palette and applying that to the outer corner and then I'm just going back and touching up the blue color so you can see it better. And then I did go ahead and wipe away all any fallout that there was and then apply a little bit more of my foundation. And then I went in with a flat definer, which I believe is the E15. I could be totally wrong. Again, I'll have everything listed down below with the dark blue color again. And I took that from the outer corner to the inner corner of my lower lash line. And then I blended that out with the Topaz shade, which we use in our crease. And then I'm taking a pencil brush from Sigma and applying Skyline to the inner corners and brow bone just to brighten everything up. And then I just went back with my E25 brush with no extra product to make sure everything was blended. And then I applied my two favorite mascaras of the moment and then I moved on to my face. So I used my Kat Von D shade and light palette to bronze up and contour a little bit. And then I did just contour my nose a little bit before moving on to blush. So I'm using NARS Orgasm and then another brush from the Nightlife brush set. And then moving on to highlighter. This was my favorite part. I was like so shocked when I put it on. You'll see it uh, just because the color is so pretty. And I applied that to all of the usual places that I would highlight. And then I just went ahead and blended it out. And then just because I did want to try out this tapered brush, I took some of the lighter shades in the Kat Von D palette and I just kind of highlighted 
a little bit and then I blended everything out. I applied some lip gloss and this is the finished look. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this look. As you can see, I went for kind of like a navy smoky eye. I honestly just kind of made it up as I was going along. I did end up loving all the products that I received, which I wasn't even surprised by. I also wanted to mention the packaging on all this is... Sorry. Jamie! I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. There it is. Okay. Oh, oh, wait, Plus wait. you. Four! <laughs> oh, I'm sick. Wait, I need to walk behind you one more time. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm gonna go get lunch, dinner. Okay, I'll be out in a sec. Okay. The packaging on all this is incredible. If you can see, it's like really sparkly. It's textured. It's amazing. The brush handles have sparkles on them, and I just, I'm so impressed. If you guys liked this look or want to purchase any of the products that I used, I will leave that link in the description. And with that said, thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll see you in my next one. This is Ellie's dinner time. Hi, sorry, one second. Sit on my next side. Time.